Wales has some of the finest coastal scenery in the world, often teeming with wildlife and ablaze with flowers. Much of this coastline is protected under the Natura 2000 network of sites of international importance for wildlife. Guillemots and razor bills are common and nest here in their thousands. They choose steep cliffs and ledges where they are safe from mammal predators, but not from the peregrine falcon. Puffins are one of the most photogenic birds of Wales, and islands like Skomer and Stockholm special protection areas provide a sanctuary for this species. The population of rabbits keep the grass low and provides burrows for nesting, and Skomer provides a place where visitors can observe these trusting and colourful birds with a minimum of disturbance. In spring and early summer, the vegetated coastal cliffs and headlands are a dazzling spectacle of flowers and are a protected feature, as on the St David's and Holy Island coast. The Welsh coast attracts crowds of visitors and nearly three million people walk the Wales coast path each year. The grassy headlands they walk support a wide diversity of species and the chuff is one of the rarest. Chuffs use their curved beaks to dig up the insects and grubs they need to raise their families, so it's important to keep the vegetation at the right level through grazing. Wales also has some of the best examples of low-lying coastal habitat, such as the natural lagoons and shingle banks at Kemlin. These are home to one of the largest colonies of sandwich terns in the UK. These Natura 2000 sites are not only beautiful places for people to enjoy, they're also vital homes for some of our most threatened and special wildlife species.